My passion for cars started when I was three years old. I don't even know where it came from. My dad kind of liked cars, but he didn't care that much about them. But I've like obsessed doesn't even begin to describe my love for cars. And it's nice to see guys out there like myself that you can just relate with that feel the same way. Some of these guys, uh, Vehicle Virgins, Doug Demuro, Salamandran, uh, Cletus, my good buddy Kyle Loftus with 1320 Video. Just a shout out to some of those guys. Love watching uh, your footage. This thing will make a road trip to Cletus and Cars, and Cletus can drive it however he wants, how fast he wants, wherever he wants. Vehicle Virgins, it's all yours. Uh, Kyle Loftus, I'll drive up to Nebraska. We'll come have some lunch, go beat on on the track. Doug DeMuro, we're Ford GT brothers. I need you. Come to Oklahoma City, come beat on this car. I've got another car too you might be interested in uh, beating on uh, and, and showing the quirks. I love your videos. Let's go grab some lunch. Chase Lautenbach, let's go beat the tar out of this thing at some SCT events. Um, spread the word, my good friend. I just need to get some attention to my cause. Help me spread the word. My number one goal in life right now is to get a Ford GT. Hoping and praying that uh, the Ford gods will bless me with that. So. Right now, I just got a, uh, it's not glamorous at all. It's just a landscape company here in Oklahoma City. Have about 19 Ford work trucks, um, but started from scratch. When I was 12 years old in 1995, first year I had three lawns, and uh, my motivation at that point was baseball cards. So my parents wouldn't just give me money, so I had to earn whatever I wanted as regards to buying anything and so uh, I went to our local uh, newspaper and I uh, tried to get a job delivering newspapers uh, when I was 11 and they just said I was too young to do it uh, what else could I do to make money cutting grass and so I was like well I can do that cut two or three yards before school started sometimes I'd skip lunch at school to go cut some grass uh, and then when I'd get home from uh, school, I'd go cut grass until dark or until soccer practice. You know, I'd make about 75 bucks a week doing that. Um, and that's what started Nelson Landscaping. There's nothing fancy about what I do, but it's my landscape company has afforded me to uh, live the American dream and drive the car I you know, fell in love with in 2004 when it came out. I daily drive this Ford GT, like you've seen, it's got over 41,000 miles on it. Um, the goal is to hit 100,000 miles on it. That's kind of been a goal of mine from the day I bought it. So uh, no doubt I'll do that. Honestly, Ford GT is, uh, it's where my heart is. Whatever I gotta do to make a Ford GT happen, I'm game for that. I turned in the first round of applications and got politely declined. So I thought maybe just maybe um, if I could pray to the Ford gods out there and uh, have this video go across the right eyes that uh, maybe we would get fortunate and uh, land one of these things. Would love to have it, you know, take it on a road trip, document all of that. Uh, my goal would be to hit every state in America. It would just be an epic experience. So um, would love to document all that on video and share it with the world. This car has gone to Redline for Kids, which is a great program that uh, some local friends of ours put on. Um, you know, we go to children's hospitals and allow the kids to hang out with the cars, get in the cars, ask questions about the cars, and it just lights up their day. Uh, so thank you, Eric and Chance Wynn, for uh, putting that on. It's, uh, it's really an incredible event. So there's not a more passionate Ford guy in this entire world. I would have 10 Ford GTs if I could afford them. I've set my pennies aside, my lawn mowing money aside to afford a new Ford GT. And this is no BS. I, you, by all means, check out my website, nelsonlawnservice.com, nelsonlandscapingok.com. Um, I'm just a lawn boy from Oklahoma City and uh, passionate about my 4GT. It's the love of my life, second to my wife and three-year-old daughter. But uh, if you let me have one of these new 4GTs, I promise you it will get seen as much, if not more, than any 4GT you guys have built. I'll make sure all of my friends in the social media world see it. Um, we'll do some really cool stuff with it. Uh, I'll probably see Europe soil. I'll ship it over there and do some road trips. Um, I'm just a nobody, but uh, I sure love Fords.
and uh, I would kill. Well, I wouldn't kill for this Ford GT, but I would do whatever I needed to do. Oklahoma needs one of these. 